think who's operating the camera thought it would be really a good idea to maybe show you guys what an 8-track player does. And we're actually fiddling with this because the um, one of our arcade video games called Two Tigers runs on an 8-track. So what I wanted to show you first is the inside of one. This is a, a deck that would go in your car. You can actually still buy these. We, we actually bought a few of these brand new from Realistic, the Radio Shack manufacturer. They were the kings. And they crammed everything in this little deck. 8-track tapes are a continuous loop of tape. And they can hold up to, I guess, 90 minutes. There may have been some that were longer. And it just keeps feeding in on itself. So there's no end. And what they did, though, they have what they call four tracks. They call it eight tracks because there's four separate uh, song tracks and there's stereo channels, left and right. So you have a left and right track one, left and right track two, left and right track three, etc. Uh, Chris has set up his workbench here so we could test this. Yeah. So we get really good true stereo out of these speakers. This would have been in the car. Now, what made this unique is by hitting the program button, it would move the head down. Now, look down there. There's, there's the head. Now, what it's done is it moves the, the head's moved down to play the next two tracks. And you get really good stereo. Too. Now we're on the next one. And then there's the last track. Now, there may, this may be blank. Yeah, there's the starting another one. And then what you had, same old-fashioned stereo, left and right, between the two speakers, and tone. 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 So, there was not much adjustment. But I guess if you put bigger speakers and you'd have different... It's surprising how much they packed in this, because remember, the circuit board, that's the amplifier right here on the top, it all ran off of 12 volts, and we have a small converter up here. So it, the, the amplifier really needs a little more amperage, but this is good enough for you to show. Now, see this switch here? That actually turns the tape on and off. So when I slide the tape out, it turns everything off, the amplifier and the motor. When you slide it in, there's a moment delay until the amplifier warms up. What they call instant on, no tubes. <laughs> now, there's another, uh, contact in here. I want you to look in there. This, oops, <laughs> this one right here, that there. You see, there's two metal slugs. Let me shine the light in. Can I see? Oh, turn your light on, Frank? Yeah, there we are. You see these two here? They're two identical pieces of metal, and if you lay a metal piece across it, it'll shift the track, switch it automatically. Well, a piece of foil tape on the tape itself that holds the tape together. That'll run over the heads and then switch the track. So at the end of track one, it'll switch itself, track two, switch. Now they use that same metal tape in movie theaters that used to run film. Now everything's being converted, but they had automation up there. So they had foil, and when the foil goes by, you can actually see it when they run the films. The lights will dim down when the feature starts. There's another piece of foil that'll tell the curtains to open wider or thinner depending on the film. So foil sensing is, is, was widely used. They even used the TV stations to signal the commercial coming up because everything's automated. The, the projection rooms, they have 15 screens, but there's only one projectionist that kind of floats around to keep everything working. Anyway, back to the 8-track. Very compact, great design. And this is the Two Tigers 8-track. The Bally Midway Two Tigers deluxe version, which we have a video, we did a video and posted that, uh, has this 8-track player in it. If you have the Two Tigers regular edition, which in fact was a kit for Tron, you just had the sounds that were on the board. But with this tape, they were able to get all kinds of great sound and special effects, as you will hear. Uh, even, even a little music, courtesy of the 8-track player. So now it is loading. I get, oh, you know what? And that's what I wanted to tell you. It's only recorded on one track. The head never moves. Track one is the only thing that has anything on it. Track two, three, and four don't. So what they do on these eight track tapes, they disconnect the automatic uh, feed, which is what we did. So it's only on this track. Now you can kind of... To me, it sounds like wind. There's also... Music that I'll play every now and then, occasionally you hear voices. No, 
not a whole lot is coming is happening in this. But in stereo, up inside the head, supplemented with the really great sounds of the game, you'll hear both in, in fact. You can hear now you can hear ricochet and bullets and stuff. It's really sharp. With all that in in tune, it's really, really fantastic. We just had this tape fixed. There's a man uh, on eBay. I got it $30. He'll fix your 8-track tape and make a DVD co or CD copy of it. So you have both that you can run. You, you can have a CD copy of your track tape and then you can fix it. There are still people that love 8-tracks. I don't know about paying $30 to fix your 8-track. <laughs> Since Olivia Newton-John you can buy used for a dollar, but if you have a custom tape like Two Tigers, you got to have it. you got to have this tape. Anyway, I hope that gave you a little instruction. Uh, big deluxe players, everything's pretty much the same. They may have a, a more stable motor. And remember, this player banged around in your car. They actually made a car 45 RPM record player. They actually played records in your car. How awful that could have been, because that was a needle. So you hit a bump, boom, and the needle would bounce around. And on top of that, if you left the records out on the dash, they'd all melt. That, I don't think that went over too well, but you can find that on eBay too. Anyway, got a quick learn lesson on 8-track tapes and how they work and how they play. Good night. We're in the Yellow Pages under Amusement. Ah, living is good, isn't it, folks? That's all for now. Good night.